right, Battletech fans. I was sent this tweet earlier in the day by Worldwide Goji Kai Productions. It was pretty interesting. I thought I'd share it with you because we're about to have some fun with this. Since Battletech is trending, I decided to have an AI write a short story based on the final throwdown between Kerensky and Amaris. It's a hot mess. Read it out loud if you dare. Now, I haven't read the story yet, <laughs> so I'm flying blind. I'm just going into this and we're just going to see you laugh, you lose. Starting, let's put the, the clock on the, the board. Two intelligent uncles shooting to the beat. A short story by Goji Kaichu. Alexander Kerensky had always hated darkened Unity City with its bitter, boiling bomb craters, burning buildings. It was a place where he felt ambivalent. He was a thoughtless, traitorous cocoa drinker with bald legs and a golden corral bib taint. His friends saw him as a putrid, purring protector of Star League. Once, he had even brought a split-legged battle mech back from the brink of death. That's the sort of man he was. Alexander walked over to the window and reflected on his charred surroundings. The clouds danced like thinking stray cat. Then he saw something in the distance, or rather, someone. It was the figure of Stefan Ameris. Brother. Stefan was a savior despot with a fat legs and a sloppy taint. Alexander gulped. He was not prepared for Stefan. As Alexander stepped outside and Stefan came closer, he could see the lively smile on his face. I am here because I want revenge, Stefan bellowed in a dictatorial tone. He slammed his fist against Alexander's chest with the force of 9 GG turkey vulture. 966 turkey vultures. I gotta read that again. I am here because I want revenge, Stefan bellowed in a dictatorial tone. He slammed his fist against Alexander's chest with the force of 966 turkey vultures. I frigging hate you, Alexander Kerensky. Alexander looked back, even more hangry and still fingering the... <laughs> Damn it. I fucking lost. <laughs> Alexander looked back, even more hangry and still fingering the brittle las gun. Stefan, you killed the Star League. Prepare to die, he replied. They looked at each other with angry feelings, like two beautiful, bumpy, brown rats rampaging at a very malicious... The end of the Ameris Civil War, which had 80s hair metal music playing in the background and two intelligent uncles shooting to the beat. Now, I didn't flub that. I read that exactly as it appears. That's just the way it was written. They looked at each other with angry feelings, like two beautiful bumpy brown rats rampaging at a very malicious the end of the Ameris Civil War, which had 80s hair and metal music playing in the background and two intelligent uncles shooting to the beat. See, I didn't flub that. That's how it's written. Suddenly, Stefan lunged forward and tried to punch Alexander in the face. Quickly, Alexander grabbed the brittle las gun and brought it down on Stefan's skull. Stefan's fat legs trembled and his sloppy taint wobbled. He looked lonely, his body raw like an old, oily Orion mech. Then he let out an agonizing groan and collapsed to the ground. Moments later, Stefan Ameris was dead. Alexander Kerensky went back inside and made himself a nice mug of cocoa. The end. This has been a journey. Be sure to smash our like button and subscribe to our channel. Crowdfunding is when lots of people give you small amounts of money to help your passion project come to life.